hello guys welcome back to the channel hope you all are doing good so if you are not able to access your Wi-Fi router page in this video we are going to troubleshoot this issue so first check your Wi-Fi router IP address uh, for this click on the Wi-Fi icon so this is the Wi-Fi uh, name which I am using right now click on properties scroll down and this is the IP address of my Wi-Fi router in the DNS server this is the IP address okay so this is the IP ad address of my Wi-Fi router the another way you can check your Wi-Fi router IP address click on the Windows icon then type CMD uh, you will see this option command prompt right click on it then click on run as administrator now here you have to type a command uh, so the command will be IP config press enter and this will show you uh, the IP address of your router Wi-Fi router so in the default gateway this is the IP address okay now copy this IP address so I will copy the IP address okay now cut this window and open your browser and paste it here so this is my Wi-Fi router page as you can see but if you're not able to uh, access your Wi-Fi router with the IP address uh, you can type the IP address manually so type HTTPS colon slash slash then type the IP address manually okay press enter if you are getting this kind of error this site can't be reached remove the S from HTTP so I will remove the S delete the S so now the command will be HTTP colon slash slash then your IP address press enter okay now it's working one more thing you can do if uh, this is still not working change uh, use some another browser for example you can use uh, Internet Explorer if you have the browser in your computer uh, use Internet uh, Explorer or uh, Microsoft Edge to access your uh, Wi-Fi router page one more troubleshoot step you can apply if you are still getting the same error uh, right click on the Wi-Fi icon then click on this option open network and internet settings then click on this option change adapter options so this is the Wi-Fi icon I have here you can see this is my Wi-Fi right click on it click on properties now select this option internet protocol version 4 select this option then click on properties now here make sure uh, the first option is selected IP address automatically and a DNS server address automatically so make sure both the options are selected as automatic okay so these are the troubleshooting methods you can apply if you are not able to access your Wi-Fi router page this is all for the video thank you